Hello, this is Fred here from Vital Seeds. Uh, today I'm going to make a video to show you about how to do a kind of seed treatment called hot water treatment, which is a way of kind of killing any mould spores that um, you have on the, on, the, on the seed coat of the seed. And this is a really low-tech way of um, treating seeds and it works well for small seeds like lettuce or brassicas or anything small like that. Bigger seeds it doesn't work very well with. So the materials which you need to do this method are really, really basic. We've got a camping cooler, which you can pick up from pretty much anywhere. And that's good because it's insulated, so it will hold the heat in. And then the only other thing really you need is uh, one of these, which is called a sous vide slow cooker. It's actually for slow cooking things like meat at a low temperature for a very, very long time. Um, and it's electric, it plugs in to the wall. But for us this is perfect because it creates a low temperature, or a high enough temperature for us, but not a really hot temperature, so we're, we're doing this at 47 degrees. Um, and it's also got a, a kind of propeller in the bottom of it which circulates the water around. So we'll keep the whole bath at a really stable temperature. Um, so that, that, and then you need just something to preheat the seeds in. Um, and then you need to have a bowl waiting aside with cold water, which to put the seeds in after they have gone through the treatment process so they don't kind of keep cooking essentially. First of all we want to preheat the seeds um, in some water which is around 37 degrees C so we've got them in here in the mug and then they are now at the right temperature so we will now put them into here at 47 this is lettuce which needs 47 degrees for uh, 30 minutes. It's different for different seeds but we'll put up some information about that as well. So these, which have been preheated, they're just in little bags, little perforated mesh bags. It's good to have a lot of space in the bag so that the seeds can all move around inside the bag so they get a good even um, heating by the water and don't end up in a clump. So we'll just pop them in. And of course, make sure they're labelled carefully. So we've just cut little tags and put them inside each bag. So that's little leprechaun, LL. Make sure you have a waterproof pen and not any old pen because it won't work. Let's put the time on here. 30 minutes. 30 minutes, that will just time away. And we will like, every now and again, we'll come and make sure the seeds are moving around inside the bag. So we'll just give them a poke around with the little poking stick. So in kind of chemical agriculture, um, companies use fungicides and nasty chemicals like that. But this is a totally safe way, no chemicals involved, just hot water. Okay. Okay, so the seeds have now been in here for 30 minutes. And now we're gonna take them out and put them in cold water here just to kind of stop the heating process immediately. So we'll let them sit in there for a few minutes just to really totally kill the heat in the seeds. Okay so now the seeds have cooled down in the water and now I'm going to dry them. I'm going to lay them out in one layer on this sheet to dry. So that should be fine and we'll come and turn them as they dry to make sure that they're getting good air exposure. And we'll, we'll germination test these as well to make sure that the process has worked and hasn't killed them off. Um, and also, we will now go and uh, have a look at some, a comparison of some which have been treated versus some that haven't been treated. And you'll see a really massive difference. So here are the ones which weren't treated and you can see there's a They've started to go mouldy in a few different places. And then here, this one, from the same seed lot, but treated, and they're all very healthy looking. There's no mould on there whatsoever. So it's a really, really effective way of treating the seeds. Um, it can affect the storage quality of the seeds. So we were only going to do this in very small batches, sort of, of 20 packets or something like that. And then when they run out, we'll treat another batch um, just to make sure that the seeds are going to be really fresh when we sell them. And that's it. That's how you hot water treat seeds.